So hey, I'm Tony. I work in the Jetpack team at Automatic, and I'm just going to introduce uh, to you what is Jetpack and what features it actually provides to you. So basically, Jetpack essentially it's a bridge between WordPress.com WordPress and your self-hosted WordPress site. So uh, as you might be familiar, WordPress.com comes with a variety of really uh, useful and powerful features, and Jetpack brings all of those features to your self-hosted site. So why should you install it? Well. Uh, all of these features are, are, as I mentioned, really useful, and especially when you get started with your site. You're not really sure what kind of plugins you need to get started, and Jetpack provides a lot of these things for you, so you don't really need to go searching in the plugin directory for, for what you need. It's super modular, so you only need to take in the features uh, that you want to use, and you can just disable the rest. Uh, it's really easy to update, because when you update Jetpack, all of the features will be updated at once. And we have free and really active support, which is a huge plus. So uh, one of the really powerful features is stats. And this is something that is actually processed entirely in WordPress.com. So there's no load on your own site. And this is, some, uh, this is a graph that you can access in WordPress.com where you can actually see all of your self-hosted sites that you connect through Jetpack. Um, it also provides a number of cool uh, uh, content writing and editing features like Markdown. So whenever you're writing your blog post normally, you can just type in Markdown. And when you publish the post, it will all be rendered. Uh, Provide spelling and grammar checks, useful for writing longer posts or, or content of any kind, actually. Short codes, so when you want to embed content from uh, different places or when you want to do something uh, more exceptional like recipes, you don't have to make your own templates for making like a recipe look to your post. This is something that Jetpack provides you automatically. And also, you can, you, you can allow your users to subscribe to your blog and get an email like this whenever you post new content on your site. Uh, it also provides some speed improvements, like Photon, which basically uh, makes your images load faster on your site by providing them from the WordPress.com content delivery network. And it also resizes your images to exactly the size that you need so you don't load a larger image than you actually need. It provides some cool visual features to make your blog or site more pretty, like tile gallery, tile, uh, galleries and carousel. And some social features, so you can uh, add in some uh, social network buttons to the bottom of your post where uh, users viewing your site can with uh, one click share this on a social network. And also you can hook this into uh, your WordPress.com account so that whenever you post something, it'll automatically be uh, distributed to your social network accounts. You can also re uh, manage your sites remotely. So if you go into WordPress.com, you can see all of the sites that you have connected through Jetpack and you can see what plugins there are active. You can manage the, uh, the activity state, so you can disable and activate plugins there. Um, and so soon you'll, you'll also be able to manage your modules. And this is something that gets better every day, and you should really check this out. Um, also, we just launched a new Protect module um, that makes sure that no, peop uh, that no um, uh, brute force attack can actually log into your account. So uh, there's, like, it's actually surprising how many sites get, you know, like, uh, get hammered by boot protect attacks all the time. And you really don't notice this. You have no idea that something's happening unless you look at your server logs. So when you enable protect, you'll actually see whenever people are trying to, uh, trying to just uh, go through different account names and different passwords and, and get access to your account. And uh, whenever this happens enough many times, uh, the protect module will block the IP address of those machines that are trying to access your site. And you can also get notified whenever your site uh, goes down and another notification comes in your email if your site comes back up. So you can monitor the, uh, the life and the state of your site. And uh, something else to do with content, you could also uh, add in the related post feature, which is something that uh, will, at the bottom of your posts, uh, show something that's related to your post, but not, not necessarily on your own blog. So this is just through uh, other, other WordPress.com connected uh, Jetpack blogs out there, uh, or WordPress.com posts even that do something similar. And if you enable this module in your own blog post, you actually increase your chances of being discovered because other people using the Relic Post module uh, can have your site or one of your posts on your site at the bottom of, of one of their posts. And one thing to remember is you don't have to use all of these features. And there's actually way more than this, but these were some of the most popular ones that I just introduced. So you can select which ones to use. And if you want to know more or you have any questions, We've got a booth right outside the auditorium, so you can come by and talk to us, or you can visit jetpack.me, which, uh, which is our site. 
Thanks. Thank you.